Chase, what's going on? Scary. Well, what's happened? Amy. Stay away from us. What's happened to your mum? Ask her. I'm so sorry. Sorry for what? Talk to me. I don't know where to start. Well, there was obviously some kind of accident, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, it was an accident. Right, so, um, how did it happen? I don't know. Under this roof. She's been supporting me and all the time. All the time what? She killed her dad. Kerry? And Amy as well. Oh, I can't keep up with you running around like a headless chicken accusing people. Look what you did to Dawn. No, that was a misunderstanding. And this isn't? Yesterday you were absolutely convinced Dad started the fire. Yeah. Cause she let me believe that. What's any of that got to do with Kerry being rushed to hospital? Cause uh... Cause I... I grabbed her. She just... Sort of tripped over. Found red. What? Yeah, well, it's no more than she deserved. I'm not apologising for it. And she just tripped. Are you sure about that? So she got those injuries just by stumbling over? Sort of. In other words, she didn't. OK. I'll be honest, it was... It was probably more of a... Shove. What? I didn't mean to do it, it just sort of happened. Because you keep jumping to conclusions! No, I told you she confessed. But Kerry's been brilliant through all this. She was the one that raised all the money. It's guilty conscience! Her and Amy nicked the cash from the safe. They smashed up the CCTV and started the fire. It was all them. She told you that? Yeah, of course she told me that! I don't just go around attacking people for no reason! Well, Dawn might disagree with that. Hang on, I thought you said it was accidental. Yeah, it was. I was angry earlier. I'm not quite sure how it happened. Oh, God, Tracy. Look, Kerry stood there and told me she caused Dad's death. Go and ask her yourself if you don't believe me. She's not really in a position to be answering any questions right now, though, is she? Head injury. She gained consciousness briefly. GCS 10 on arrival, now 7. You need to wait here. No, I want to be with her. Sorry, that's not possible. You can wait through there. But she's going to be all right. As soon as there's any information, I'll let you know. Spent all this time trying to prove Dad's innocence and carrying you the truth all along. How could she do that to me? But to attack her like that? She lied me! She used a dead man to let herself off the hook. Are you all right with that? No, of course I'm not! Yes, then we need to call the police! No way! That is not a good idea. They need to know what Kerry and Amy did. I, I was about to phone them when it all... What? Were you not Kerry out? No. That is not what happened. Look, I might have shoved her, but... I definitely didn't mean to do it. It still doesn't look good, though, does it? She tells you about your dad and suddenly she's lying unconscious on the floor. Right, OK, so, so what did the paramedics say? What? Did they say how serious her injuries are? Well, she didn't look good when they carted her off. Hang on, why are you two so bothered about her? For all we know, she's just had a bump to the head. There's no just about a head injury, Tracy. What are you saying? It's not like she... She could die, is it? Now, let's not assume the worst just yet. Oh, my God.